Hey everyone, it's Van and today I'd like to share with you some of the gifts that the girls and I exchanged at our Christmas gathering and um, I guess it was postponed until January so it's a late Christmas gathering um, and I guess it was a surprise but they um, celebrated my birthday as well because my birthday was the day after the get together. So, um, I'm just going to start with, um, you know, in no particular order really, but, um, I have Tammy's gift right in front of me, so. Uh, first thing she gave me was this, um, box right here, and it's a wooden box with these silver closures, and she decorated with the Sweet Life papers from Melissa Francis, designed by Every Day is a Holiday. And what I like about it is um, she used like the paper straws to um, frame the glass, which is a really cute idea. And um, I don't know if I could move this up a little so you can see the embellishments. I think this might be a Melissa Francis fabric flower and um, she used some Melissa Francis resin flourish. She got this cute resin lock here with some lace going around the box and she has some more resins throughout. This is really cute. This is one of the chipboard embellishments. Um, and a cake, a slice of cake. So that's the, um, and then it looks like she splattered it with, um, I don't know what she splattered it with. <laughs> I don't know if it's glimmer mist, but it's really, I like the effect. And then she also framed the inside of the glass with, um, paper straw. And, um, she lined the inside with some papers and lace. And she did, I think, like a wash or a splattering effect on the, on this paper also with some shimmery um, mist. So, thank you, Tammy. And then she also gave me this cute pouch and inside she made me a um, compact mirror with Deco Den. And um, it's really cute and it ties in with the box that she made me really well. Ooh. So it's really cute and I, it looks so edible, <laughs> but yeah. And it's just a compact mirror and it's, um, she said that we could put it in the bag so nothing falls out while it's in our purses. So she made that. And then she also gave me this really beautiful calendar and it's like a specialty, it's on specialty paper. I don't know what it's called, but, um, these are all the months and I could totally use these when the year is done um, on projects. I could totally use them or even just frame them up. It's really pretty. So that's what Tammy gave me. Um, and then next I have Anna and I saw her video on this and I she made everyone these cork boards and you could hang it and you could put your picture here. But I saw this trim right here and I thought, I really like it and it's really pretty. I'm not usually for purple, but this is a really nice light purple, which I don't, um, I don't mind because it's like a pastel and I like it. And she put like bling on the on the dangling trim and she said it's from Trazer Deluxe, the trim. So it looks like she used two different types of trim and layered it. And then she made this beautiful flower. And yeah, it's really pretty because she did use like um, a different paper that, you know, um, that's different from Tilda because in her video she said there's more to it than Oh, and then she also added this pretty um, dangle right here. But yeah, she said she wanted to use something different other than Tilda because everyone's using Tilda papers. So thank you, Anna, so much. I will add this to my office decor. 
um, because I, I honestly have no room here. Um, and I told everyone to not make me any gifts for the Christmas gift exchange. And I, I didn't, you know, they don't listen. <laughs> but um, I love everything though, so don't get me wrong. I love it, but um, I'm just going to have to figure out how I'm going to rotate the things I display with, you know, the new things that I get. And then next I have um, Natalie. She made me these this set of bracelets right here and she used I think it's memory wire and um, each bracelet has some beautiful charms on there that um, she put on some wings and beads I think this is a seahorse yeah seahorse really pretty I wore them today to work I love them thank you Natalie and um, she also made me this beautiful card and it's a shaker card that she used the Teresa Collins Studio Gold line on. And it's, I just love it. And um, I like this right here. And she said, I remember her saying that this punch right here is like really big just to punch that word out. So I agree, which is why I didn't buy it. And then she also made everyone this cute little um, paper bucket, I guess. And she used Tilda paper, of course. Really pretty um, embellishments on it as well. And I love the bling that um, she uses on the lace trim. So, And inside she made some little embellishments for everyone. Um... So she made, I remember um, seeing a video on these and she said they were so easy to make, but they don't look easy to me. But anyway, that's just me. But she made some of these on um, paper clips and clothespins. So these are really cute embellishments to use. And then she punched out some hearts on some Tilda paper for everyone. And then she also included some doodads, like buttons and, um, let's see, flower cabochons and pearl hearts and stuff. So, really cute stuff. Thank you, Natalie. Okay, and then, um, next is Marissa. Marissa made this really cute card, and I love her coloring. Um... I don't have any Copics, so I just like watercolor with Lindy Stamp Gang. But um, her card is really cute, and she uses beautiful paper. I don't know what it's from. So there's that. And she made... Um, actually, she gave me an Ulta gift card, which I have yet to use. So I'm really excited to go to Ulta and check out um, the latest of makeup. And um, she made everyone, ooh, these deals right here. I don't know if you guys could see, but um, it's stemless wine glasses, and she personalized them with our uh, monogram on the glass, and she put a little bottle of Stella Rosa wine in there. So I already drank mine during the Super Bowl. <laughs> it was really good. It didn't take long either. But yep, she used white vinyl on my stemless wine glass and I love it. I love it a lot. And um, I'm normally not a, I don't drink alcohol at all. But, um, you know, I'm willing to try new things. So I really like the way that this Stella Rosa uh, wine tastes. So thank you, Marissa. And then um, next I have... Uh, Janelle she gave me this big old like box right here it's like a big pizza box or donut box um, it's from Prima I think it's like from their like subscription type deal and your stuff arrives in these boxes so inside she put a bunch of goodies in there um, some of the stuff is um, not even released yet, but I've been eyeing this tool forever 
and I just never brought myself to buying it and she gave it to me and I you know I never said anything about it but I'm so happy I have this tool very interested in using it and um, she included these sprays in um, cotton candy it's like a pink tone and then she also included this antique gold spray and these are I've used these before I tried them out last year in, at CHA and they were really um, ergonomically mm, correct I guess and then I, um, she also gave me the coffee break journaling note cards which I could use for cards and these things right here I think she said these are new um, not released yet so they come with these cameo type frames and they're metal and you could stick whatever letter inside you want and then she has these little match match boxes they're, they're the mini ones though so these are a new product from Prima and um, some embellishments from the coffee break line these right here and then these beautiful dimensional stickers with bling um, this beautiful trim with the ribbon and sequins through the middle and then she also included some beautiful vellum with gold foiling and then this beautiful gold paper right here, which is pretty much like mirror. Like, it reminds me of the Tim Holtz mirror sheets. And she gave me two pieces of that. So this is um, the in thing now. Gold, gold foiling. So thank you, Janelle. And she was the one that um, hosted the whole shindig party thing. So yeah, it was um, also a potluck. Or something like that. Yeah, we all brought a little something. So thank you, Janelle, for hosting also. And the next up is Rosanna. And Rosanna, she couldn't make it, which is um, unfortunate. But we understand family comes first. But thank you so much for, you know, actually mailing our stuff. It's really sweet of you. You really don't have to because we know you're going to come again. But she um, decided to mail our stuff and she made this card. I think I've seen a video. You could correct me if I'm wrong, Rosanna, but I think I've seen a video on some card that I used this stamp with and I thought it was really cute. And um, so her cards are really nice and thick and I like it a lot. And I love this seam binding flower that she made. So that's, she used the journaling card in there. So that's her info if you guys want to check her out. And um, she made me a really beautiful mini album. And it's totally like different from what I know her to make. But um, she wrapped it up with some with it in a bag and she put this beautiful um, latex prima vine on there which I could reuse but this is the mini album that she made for me and I think um, it's made with some Marion Smith papers I'm not sure I just love it it's like vintage and I I love it so she included this dangling charm that I um, know this is from the Marion Smith trinkets like years ago because I used to have this and um, she also dangled some extra beads there and that's the cover and it's a family themed mini album so I could choose to put pictures of my family or yeah just family so she has this beautiful closure and she made this dangle on the closure and inside it's I just like I kept looking at it she included some tags um, I think some of the pages fold out yeah so yeah that's the page 
And this folds out. I just love it. I don't think anyone has ever... Actually, I do have one other mini album that um, my friend Van made for me. So, yeah, this is just a, bunch, uh, a lot of journaling spots and cards, and she embellished it so well. This would take me forever to make. And this, this is a really cute little bag. I don't know if she made it or people sell that. I'm not sure. But um, this is really cute. Looks like she used glossy accents on the hats and mustaches. So really, really beautiful mini album, Rosanna. Thank you so much. And I was really surprised that you made this for me. I'm so, like, surprised. Thank you so much. And um, I'm going to try closing this. So, yeah, I'm going to try and fill this up with some photos. Thank you, Rosanna. And this is, um, she used the Seven Gypsies, um book board for the mini album so it's really sturdy really hard nice and um she made everyone a valentine's day gift too this is a really cute strawberry box which she embellished with some tool in this owl clip and she just included some stickers and embellishments i like this heart pom-poms which i don't have some of this um, these are buttons and a pillow box and let me see oh and the pillow box has a bunch of these chipboard elements and I don't know where they're from and then she made everyone oh she included these also like these pebbles and these this chenille heart with some doilies really pretty i wonder where she got these doilies from the one with the cupid but i love them so thank you so much rosanna i really appreciate your gifts it's beautiful and then um i gotta move like the other side of the camera but um, next I have Roxy, and she made everyone these candles, and these are some Tilda candles. Um, she, I saw her video on this, she said she spray painted it, and she used like um, wax paper, I think, or tissue. She heat dried, he, he, she used the heat gun to melt the wax a little bit so the image would stick onto the candle. But um, she also added the word love down there, and she added a little bling piece or pearl heart. And she just packaged it up so cute that I'm just going to leave it like that. And um, I did have it um, displayed on my Ikea Expedit on top of there, because that's where I display some of the stuff that um, people have given me over the years. And then she also made these um, photo holders, which are really cute. And it has our name. So you just stick a photo in there like that. Thank you, Roxy. And then um, last but not least is Vicky. Vicky couldn't make it because she had to take care of her mom, which is... Um, <sighs> I just wish you could catch a break, Vicky. But... Um, we, we really missed you there, and of course we're going to see you again soon. So, she, Vicky made everyone these, um, I, I don't know, they're like cow scarves or infinity scarves. I'm not sure what they're called, but these are really, um, I put it on right when I got it. And I love this color. It's just white, really. But it's really cute, a really pretty accessory. And then she made, I remember seeing her video on these glass heart ornaments that she made. And I thought they were so pretty. But she gave me one. Ooh, it's going to focus soon. But um, 
Yep, this is the heart ornament that she gave me and I'm totally displaying that. It's not even like, you don't even need to wait for Christmas to put this up, but it has um, the, she used, I think the Teresa Collins Love Word Punch and she stuck some, um, looks like she stuck some crystal trim and some mica flakes in there, some fabric, and some tinsel trim in there, and that's her YouTube. It's actually Try Hard um, 67, I believe. So yeah, I really love this ornament. Thank you, Vicky. And then she um, made this glassine bag. She just Mod Podge a Christmas napkin over the glassine bag. And I have been trying to, I have been wanting to try that, but um, never got around to it. And then she also made this beautiful um, woven, fabric woven basket for me, which is um, so pretty. She used some shabby fabric. And I can't believe, ooh, whoops. <laughs> I can't believe she made this for me because it looks like it's really time consuming. And then inside she filled it up with these um, Honolulu Cookie Company pineapple shaped cookies. And they're all different flavors. This one looks like it has a coffee bean in there. And this is chocolate dip. This looks like it's some sort of fruit jelly. But yeah, I can't wait to start eating these. I haven't started yet. But what I dropped were these... Um, these wire love words which she made and um i saw these at a art fair um a while ago when we all went together and i wanted to buy it and she's like these are really easy to make <laughs> and i i don't remember if i asked her to make these for me but um she made them for me and she wrapped them in with different things so this one looks like she used like raffa raffia paper maybe to wrap the wire word and um this one she used some yarn or some sort of burlap string i just love the way these came out and you could totally use these on um canvases or just hang it on your wall this one looks like a thinner type of burlap string and um, this one is in like a pink yarn along with some of this eyelash looks like type of yarn and um, this is a thicker yarn I just love the way she made these and then this one's in red wire some silver and this smaller one in the raffia um, trim. And I believe that is it. I don't think I missed anything, um, but yeah, that's it. Thank you all so much for my birthday gifts and gift exchange gifts. I really appreciate everything that I got. Um, you should have seen the look on my boyfriend's face when I walked in with the bags, because. He just gave me that look like, no. And I said, you know what? I'm going to enjoy my birthday. <laughs> but yeah, thank you all for watching and have a good day. Bye.